Hello, my crafting buddies. Thanks for stopping by today. This is RJ, your Thrifty Crafter. I hope everyone is having a wonderful week today. I know it's been hot here in California, up in the 100s, and I'd be glad we had some um, cool down weather. Today I'm here to share with you quickly another embossed um, inspired card. So let's get started. Um, the products that I use, I use Spellbinders Floral Jewel. Um, here's the embossing folder. I don't know if you guys can see how deep the impressions are in this. It gives you a 3D effect. Um, I use some Vintage Collection Coordinations. Um, this is a 6x6 pack. And I apologize for the glare. And I use that. I use a Spellbinders die and a Spellbinders fancy tag um, for my um, embellishments and my flower. Um, so let me share that with you quickly. So you guys, here's my card. And as you can see, um, with the, with the um, coordinations... Um, this particular line is that it's just, it's the lighter color of the darker color that um, when you sand it shows up, and so that's what I did. I used the um, I sand it to give you so you can see the um, the dimensions of the uh, embossing folder. And I add a little brad to my um, flower, and there's the hello from a fancy tag. I think this is. Um, one or two, but um, if you look in the description or go to my blog, um, I will have more information there. Um, this is a A2 size card that uh, it's a top fold, which means it folds up like that. Oh, I haven't decorated anything yet, you guys, but um, I need to do that later. So there's my card. Um, if you like my card, please like my video. Uh, I hope I'm inspiring you guys to pull out your embossing folders and. Um, create some projects. I love to see them. Um, if you're a Facebook friend, just tag me. Um, if you're on uh, Instagram, tag me there as well. I love to see your um, projects. Okay, you guys. Thanks so much for stopping by again. As always, in parting, I wish you peace, love, and blessings. Until next time, take care. Bye for now.